Hello everyone, I'm Destiny Diamond. Welcome or welcome back to my channel where I do kitten content as well as wholesome content and now mommy vlogging content. I'm going to be giving you guys a tour of the dresser that's right behind me. I use it as a diaper changing table amongst other things. And um, when I was pregnant, these are the type of videos that I would look at just to get some ideas on how I want to, hi Lily, this is my cat right here, <laughs> of how I want to organize my dresser. I want it to be fully functional and I want it to have purpose. And I also want it to be organized to make my life as a mom easier. So without further ado, let's get to it. Say hi, Elijah. <laughs> okay. I'm going to start with the actual dresser itself. This dresser I got from Ikea for $350. I'm going to be linking everything as much as I can down below in the description box. This is actually the only thing that I bought other than this planner right here. Everything else you see here, I just want to make clear that I got as a gift. <laughs> yes, I got as a gift either for my baby shower or birthday or Christmas or otherwise. Mm. Yeah, even from co-workers and everything. Hi, baby. Mm. Yeah. You want to lay down? Okay, let me lay him down really quick. Now the baby is asleep, but I kind of forgot where I was. One other thing that I did by myself that was not a gift was this book. I just want to show you guys really quick um, what it looks like in the front. <clears throat> This is to track all of your feedings, as well as sleep time, diaper changes, etc. When your baby is first born, you get so many doctor's appointments and they always ask you, how many ounces is the baby drinking right now? How much sleep is he getting? Does he do um, at least six diapers a day? Um, is he dehydrated? And things like that. You can also write special notes right here. Um, so this, at first, when you have a newborn, is really beneficial to have however i kept it even though he's four months now i did keep it because for example when your baby is sick they want to know how healthy your baby is at the moment if they're still doing regular diapers as you see here when we had covid he had diarrhea so he had um a lot of poo poo <laughs> at that moment so this is really good to have and neat if you want to keep organized. I will also link that down below. These are really my only decorational pieces. God has great plans for me. And then I also have a praying bear. Now I lay me down to sleep. I pray the Lord my soul I do also have a nightlight for those nighttime diaper changes. Definitely want to see what you're doing there. On top here, just diapers, wipes, booty cream, as well as lotion. This lotion is also really good for baby acne. If you don't know what baby acne is, pretty simple. When you are breastfeeding, you are transmitting hormones into your baby's body, and sometimes they get acne. And so this kind of relieved, actually 100% relieved my baby's acne within, I think, about three days, which was really nice. It was a lifesaver there. Just wanted to let you guys know that this Ikea dresser was not bought with this diaper changing table. It is not attached. This just so happened to be gift gifted to me and just so happened to be the exact same color. So I got lucky. When I do diaper changes, I also like to have this mat down just in case he pees or, you know, goes number two. And I know you guys love Lily. So hi, Lily. Say hi. Yeah. Oh my goodness, you're so tired. Let me leave you alone. So I'll just lay down this mat like so and change the baby's diaper. All right, so let's get to the first dresser drawer. I have a whole bunch of miscellaneous items in here, starting with the wipes. I do also love the nose, Frida. I actually really do like that product. This is, <laughs> I got this as a gift. Actually, I really liked this product. It's kind of a nipple cream and also your baby can digest it safely. You will need this when you are breastfeeding. That's Desitin, that's Aquaphor. I kind of wanted to buy a few different um, diaper creams just to see which one I liked. I actually ended up liking the Birds and Bees multi-purpose healing ointment. It smells so good. All right, and then this is also for baby acne. I would get this as well if you have a baby that struggles. Oatmeal scent, guys. I just didn't like it. I'm not sure. It kind of just made my baby smell like sweat. Just wanted to let you guys know. 
Lastly, I do have a bunch of miscellaneous items such as the nose sucker, some scissors, brushes, nail files, tongue cleaners, um, when I take the baby's temperature, combs. Going on to the second drawer, I just have diapers in here. <laughs> as for the next drawer, these are all bibs. This is a bib bandana. These are the burping cloths in the back. Next, I actually intended to make this only my breastfeeding um, drawer, but it ended up being, of course, miscellaneous items. This is for the diaper genie. These are the bags. I do have the diaper genie right there. Um, the lid doesn't close at the moment. It does close, but uh, not at the moment. I have all of these mittens right here. I have a stack of them. It just it doesn't even fit in the little box that I put there anymore. This right here is a high blood pressure monitor. I did have high blood pressure during my pregnancy and then a little bit postpartum. And then this is the breast pump that I use. I use the Zo Zoomy, Zomi? Not really sure how to pronounce it. Going on to the next drawer. I just have all of his clothes. I do use, um, I forgot exactly what method, folding method that I use, but I will link it in the description box down below, just in case you guys would like to learn how to fold like this. This first row is his sweaters, second row is his onesies. This is long sleeved onesies. These, oh, I absolutely love. Okay, this is another thing that I bought after um, he was born. These are all of his holiday outfits. So back here I have Halloween. Then I have Turkey Day as well as some woodland creatures for the fall. And then last but not least, um, Christmas. This row right here is jumpsuits. This row right here is footie pajamas. I actually did want to show you guys the dividers as well. Um, they're clear dividers, very discreet, not too obvious. Um, but I did also get that on Amazon. next drawer this drawer is just a continuation of his clothing i have some shorts right here all pants hats um socks i mean jeans you guys can already tell this is more of a miscellaneous drawer as well these i got from someone who had a premature child and so these swaddles actually never fit him in the first place however i do like to lay these down just in case he drools or makes a mess on the bed so like let's say he just ate some formula i would lay this on the bed first so that my bed doesn't get dirty <laughs> um this is just can be thrown in the washer really quick so these are convenient to have this is a carrier it's a body carrier so that you can carry your baby around on your body this is a scrapbook. I will be scrapbooking, you guys. Maybe I'll make a video of it sooner or later. And then back here um, is a playmat. And then under the playmat, I'm not even going to show you guys, but it's um, all of his discharge papers from the hospital, as well as his social security card, um, his birth certificate, his immunization records. So I have just like a little folder for him right there as well. Last but not least this drawer it's actually a toy chest so we have all of these wonderful books with abc's one two threes color shapes you name it we got classics like winnie the pooh and pete the cat even books about emotions touch and feel books so all of these developmental books i really enjoy last but not least just like a little toy box we have shakers um teddy bears um, things that make noise, just things that are going to grab his attention during tummy time. Um, I do have some teethers here as well. Here's another one. Now, um, one thing that I do want to add to this toy chest, toy chest that I do not have is blocks, stacking cups, um, probably some watercolors or something. And I believe that is it for now oh yeah and i would really like some toy cars for him when he gets a little bit older all right so that sums up the organizational components of the dresser if you did want to do a little sneak peek of what is around the dresser i do have the diaper genie so i can quickly throw away his diapers as well as the laundry basket right around the corner here i do have a very sad looking pillow on this rocking chair 
Um, I like having the stack of blankets right next to the rocking chair just for convenience. This is a foot spa that I got. Um, sorry about all these cords, but this is a foot spa that I got as a gift. This is his play mat. And then my kitty, my little, little kitty. Oh, yeah. If you guys want to know how Lily is with the baby, she loves him. She's very affectionate and we do not have any issues with her. Right, baby? Again, all of the products that I know where they came from will be listed down below. If you'd like to see more mom content, please hit the subscribe button as well as the like button if you like this video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye!